I thought I would talk about fashion trends that you already have in your wardrobe so you don't have to go out and buy new items. You can just kind of play around in your closet and grab out the pieces and just play around with them, restyle them, revamp them, whatever you want to call it. Um, so I was laying up on the couch the other night and I literally could not sleep for hours. And this idea popped into my mind. I'm sure lots of people have already done a similar video, but I don't know. I just thought it would be fun. So that's what we're going to be doing today. If you're new to my channel, I don't know why, why am I doing this? Who, why? Okay. If you're new to my channel, welcome. My name's Angelique. I make new videos twice a week about luxury and fashion. And if that is something you're into, then I definitely think you should hit that subscribe button down below. So starting off with the first trend, which is definitely one of my favorites, and that is animal print, guys. Animal print was super super big last year and um, it's not going anywhere anytime soon. It is still all over the place. We're seeing it all over Instagram, um, Pinterest. It's just everywhere, especially snake skin print. I don't know why I find that so hard to say. Um, but also we're seeing a lot of leopard print. Now, leopard print is the key. I think that most of us have some sort of a leopard print item, clothing item in our wardrobe already. At least I did. I had a blouse that was probably five years old. Um, I did throw it away though because yeah, it was just, it was kind of bad. Um, but anyways, my point is that most of us probably have some sort of a leopard print or any kind of animal print item in our wardrobe already. And uh, maybe from last year, maybe from a couple years ago, but don't throw that piece away, get it out of your closet and just, you know, style it up. So for me, leopard print is, oh, not leopard print, animal print in general uh, is like a statement piece. Um, so let's say I'm wearing a leopard print top. I will keep the other items around it very neutral and same goes the other way around. If I'm wearing um, a pair of pants that are animal print, I'll keep the rest very neutral. So I'm kind of letting that item be the star of the show and dressing, I'm dressing around that piece if that makes sense. So I think that's really key to pull those kind of pieces off. Now there are people out there that can rock like a full on animal print look. Not me guys, not me. I like to keep it pretty basic and then just have a one piece kind of stand out. All right, moving right along to trench coats. All right, I know what you're thinking. Trench coats never go out of style and you're absolutely right, they don't. They are always popular, they are a staple piece. So I personally think, but who am I guys? Just my personal opinion. Um, I think that every single person should definitely own a trench coat in their wardrobe, okay? It doesn't matter what color or cut, just whatever suits you and whatever you like, it's Trust me, it's such a versatile piece and you're gonna get so much use out of it. So I'm obviously talking about this because I'm assuming most people already have a trench coat. And like I said, trench coats never go out of style, but I feel like we're seeing them a lot this season. They're just all over the place. <laughs> place. People are loving them and yeah, so grab your trench coat out and wear it. Now, did that even make sense? Grab your trench coat out. Okay, just grab your trench coat and wear it. Um, for trench coats, the way I like to style them, it's pretty much with absolutely anything. And I know that sounds kind of crazy, but I really think you can't go wrong with, you know, anything. If you wear a tracksuit and um, a pair of sneakers, pop your trench coat on and I think you're good to go. Or if you're wearing something more chic and business-like, pop your trench coat on and it will look amazing. Um, that's just that's just what I go by. I could be wrong. But uh, yeah, I think a trench coat pretty much goes with whatever you want it to. Next is the linen trouser. And oh my God, am I obsessed with this trend. So the linen trouser, very basic, very simple, very casual, but you can dress it up or you can dress it down. And I think that this is a perfect, you guys, perfect piece for spring and summer because they're lightweight, they're flowy, they're comfortable, and yeah, they're just, they're, they're perfect. Like you don't have to wear jeans and be all sweaty and hot. Just throw on a pair of linen trousers and you're gonna be nice and comfy for the rest of the hot summer days. Um, linen trousers, again, the, I feel like all of the pieces that I'm talking about today are gonna be so simple to style. Um, so I'm not gonna talk about the linen trouser too much, but again, very easy to put an outfit together with them. Uh, I personally love wearing them with sneakers and just a regular shirt. I feel like if you keep all the colors neutral, it looks very like classy and 
a little bit expensive, if you will. Um, or you could pop on a pair of heels and maybe a button up or some kind of a cute crop top and you know wear it for a night, wear them for a night out. So yeah, lots and lots of options with linen trousers. Okay, let's move right along to shoes. Now, let me just quickly say that I'm gonna have an entire video dedicated to shoes coming up. Um, we're gonna talk about all the trendy shoes at the moment that you need. So keep an eye out for that. Okay, so the shoes I wanna talk about, or the trend I wanna talk about, is Western style booties. So I'm talking about something like this. And I know most of you are probably like, Angelique, I do not have any Western boots uh, in my wardrobe. But I do think that most people have like a similar, like I'm talking about the shape and you know the pointed toe, kind of something similar to this. Uh, I feel like most people have a booty like that. Anyways, I see lots of people wearing them all the time. Um, so I, let me be honest with you guys. With this trend, I feel like some of the boots are pretty hideous and um, I'm not a big cowboy boot fan anyways. I do have a horse, so I do own probably five pair of actual cowboy boots. And yeah, it's just not my favorite thing in the world. So I kind of like the cross between a Western boot and a biker boot. and these boots give me that exact vibe. Now, I did pick these up about three or four years ago and I never ever wore them. They just sat in my wardrobe. I got them from Nasty Girl, by the way. So I'm gonna hopefully find them or I'm gonna see if I can still find them for you guys and I'll link them down below. Um, but they're so cute and they're so comfortable and they look good with absolutely, well, most things. I don't like styling this type of shoe with shorts and a t-shirt, that's just not my vibe, but I love wearing something like super sophisticated and dressy and then popping a shoe like this on. I don't know, I just feel like it breaks it up, it makes it edgy and it just, yeah, it makes it look cute. So any kind of booty that you have in your wardrobe that's a bit pointed and just looks a, a tiny bit a tiny bit western or um edgy will work but yeah we're seeing these kind of boots all over the place and i i'm really liking it Alrighty, and then last but not least let's talk about blazers um okay so this is probably my favorite trend at the moment i wore something similar in i think two videos ago and it is just wearing a blazer with a belt around it to kind of cinch in your blazer so that whole suiting, that whole suiting vibe. I don't know why I do that, guys. Why do I do that? Um, so yeah, just uh, just think of wearing a blazer like or a suit, and then instead of like just closing it up or leaving it open, just cinching it in with a belt. Oh, you guys, I think that looks so incredibly amazing. It just I don't know. It looks sexy and it looks sophisticated, but it also looks like very fashion forward. I don't know. I just think it's super cool. <laughs> Um, so yeah, but I'm sure that absolutely everyone, let me know if I'm wrong, please do, but I think absolutely everyone has some sort of a blazer in their wardrobe and this look you can do with any blazer. Doesn't matter what um, shape or size or color, just get it out, pop a belt over top of it. You could do a slim belt, you could do a bigger belt, whatever, whatever you feel like, and uh, you're good to go. You're on trend. Uh, I, I love this look. I really, really do. Okay, that is it for today's video. I really hope you guys enjoyed this. If you did, please do give it a thumbs up. Uh, also, let me know in the comments down below if you do have any of these items that I talked about, um, because I don't know, I'm just curious to know. Also, what are some of your favorite fashion trends? Uh, I don't know, I'm just, I'm really liking most of the trends this spring and summer. Usually I don't, but this year I'm, I'm loving a lot of them. Um, so yeah, let me know what's your favorite trend. And uh, yeah, don't forget to subscribe and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.